My name is Leticia Hagui, and I am a Fort Worth artist that uh, started as a photographer and has merged into fiber arts, um, printing my photographic imagery onto cotton and then sewing those pieces into um, quilts, dresses, quilt tops. And that's really like conversations between uh, my ancestry and my Self. So with the quilts, I had a lot of women in my family who were quilters. And some of them I never met, but I have their quilts, like great-grandmothers and things like that. And so um, I really like tying into what I feel was their art form and bringing it into mine. So it's like a conversation through the generation, um, but using contemporary images. When I first started as a photographer, I saw myself as a documentary photographer and I thought I was going to travel the world and, you know, shoot war-torn <laughs> countries and all this kind of stuff. And um, I always had this sort of crafty side, mm -hmm. but I never brought it into my real um, work. And when I went to grad school, I started playing with that. And I think when I was able to bring the craftiness in with the documentary, it really was like bringing two halves of my brain together. Right. And the work really sort of came out with Phil LaBelle. Uh, the imagery onto facts that have a history built into them. I really love that. Um, I like uh, romantic mm -hmm. photographic images and piece them and create his own piece. Uh, I like a lot of documentary photographers. Uh, I still, that's where I always start with my work, the image first, and then it becomes something else. Mm -hmm. So I still look at a lot of uh, documentary photographers. Too. Well, I like to bring in objects that have a history to them with mm -hmm. pieces. So a lot of the fabrics that are not photographed are family heirlooms or stuff that I found in thrift shops or antique shops that have a history built into it. So, uh, yeah, I was just talking to Erin about the challenge that is with each show because I feel like um, setting up an exhibition is as much an art form as it is making the actual art pieces. And so I've been learning a lot just with her today, facing the show and, and giving things flow. And, right. Um, I think key was because it's such a long space, was making sure that each piece had its own weight around it, open right. weight around it. Um, and she's brilliant.